Ukrainian military shot down another Russian missile carrier ship in Kursh. The damage inflicted by the Ukrainian strike on the Russian missile carrier, which was docked at the Zaliv shipyard in Kursh, will not allow the Russian Black Sea Fleet Command to put the vessel on combat duty anytime soon. That's according to Natalia Humeniuk, the Chief Press Officer of Operational Command South, answering the question of whether the damage to the Russian warship will weaken the threat coming from the Black Sea. As for the strike on the Kirsch shipyard, the aftermath has not yet been fully verified, but we are talking about the fact that the strike was powerful, successful and absolutely legitimate, since these are the forces that ensure the enemy's combat capability. We do not yet have a full report on how bad the modern missile carrier is damaged, but based on the pictures we've seen, the damage is quite significant. This means that the carrier will definitely not come back to service anytime soon, Hugh Menyuk said. As reported on November the 4th, sounds of inbound missiles and explosions were heard in Kirsch, the city in the eastern part of the Russian-occupied Crimea. Local publications referring to eyewitnesses reported a plume of smoke coming up in the area of the Zaliv shipbuilding plant. The armed forces of Ukraine confirmed that the strike damaged the Zaliv shipyard. Ukraine's Air Force Commander Lieutenant General Mykhailo Oleschuk added that one of the most modern ships in service with the Russian Black Sea Fleet, a caliber cruise missile carrier, was docked at the shipyard at the time of the strike. Natalia Humeniuk emphasized that Ukraine's forces see such facilities as the Zaliv shipyard as their legitimate military target.